Do people with a smile and a laugh. <laughs> it is disarming. And you'll notice the Dalai Lama is always smiling and laughing. <laughs> and so am I. Dal, help. Help someone you love. Help someone today. Make it a point to help. Dal, serve. <sighs> serve your family, serve your community, serve your country, serve your planet. Serve life. Serve. Serve the earthworms. <laughs> or help the earthworms. I'm on Dao Du. Coming to you from the heartland of Zen on a Dao Day. What's a Dao Day? A Dao Day is a cloudy day, a rainy day. Just like you'll have a Dao Day when you don't quite feel up to go. Well, there are Dao Days too. It's not a sunny day. Don't see the sun. But you know the dew is up there. You may not see it. But as a sadu, you know it's there. You don't need to see it to know it's there. You just know it's there. <laughs> I don't get upset. Oh my God, the sun is gone. What am I gonna do? Oh my gosh, it's over. <laughs> it's gotta come back. Just like your bad days or having a down day and you undo that situation as an un, undo. Dealing with a Trump supporter. <laughs> Lot of, they're some crazy motherfuckers, aren't they? Excuse my French. I'm a monk that swears. I say how it is. Don't take offense to that. This is where I live. I live and uh, Japan is transforming right now into a land of lakes. They're filling up the tambos. Tambo, tambo. There's rice fields, everything else. And I'm on my path. This is the path of Undaudu. One day may become a, a sacred pilgrimage. <laughs> People will come here just to walk my footsteps with their virtual hologram of me walking back and forth making these talks because my friend I am immortal <laughs> I am definitely immortal with all my talks on YouTube with all my thoughts that I've put online creating a virtual um, undoubt is a guarantee <laughs> So my ancestors, Tommy and Mikey and their children and their children and their children will look back and talk to great, 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 great ancestor Undaudu. The crazy Sadu, Duist, who ushered in the fifth age, who predicted all of this. And now we're actually in the third stage of the fifth age, which is right here which is the age of singularity. So we have the age of Bitcoin, the age of blockchain. Now we're in the age of singularity, which is AI. There is 0202 staring out at you. So I want to talk about the singularity, the education singularity that I first talked about in around 2005, 2006, as I realized that autonomous driven education is doable to remove the teacher and school barrier to learning because they're barriers you know i have to go to school i have to have a teacher to learn no you're gonna have obey be both and deliver to you and a great thing if you haven't done it there's khan academy i can't I always forget or maybe i'll link him up there who's already starting having an ai assistant now it's not autonomous it doesn't push it doesn't watch what you're learning and everything else but that's just a small little pivot for that to happen. And ultimately, uh, but you can see the direction we're headed. Um, you know, I live in Japan and now I realize why I'm here in rural Japan in this area. Japan is facing 
a crisis. They're, uh, they're, they're projected to go down to uh, 70, 80 million people in the next uh, 20 years, 10 years, 20 years. They're, they're hemorrhaging people. They're not having enough babies and everything else. And everyone's, you know, it's a big deal. It's actually a good thing because what it means is they're going to have to rely on AI to uh, take a lot of positions. So think about like all manager positions, you can replace that. You don't need managers anymore. AI can be your manager, right? It can, it can push assessments, push direction, keep you on track, way better than a human flawed manager. So managers, attorneys, accountants, all them, not needed. AI can do a better job creating, you know, looking at all the, the history of um, uh, filings and everything else, and it, they can create the, uh, you know, the legal documents, they can do the accounting, you don't need them, all obsolete. So think of all the accountants, all the attorneys, you know, ultimately being displaced. You will need an attorney to, you know, you'll need an attorney to file, to be in court, but all the rest of the stuff, you know, all these law firms are gonna hemorrhage people. Um, and that's good for Japan. So you have a legal system. Um, all, I mean, all the support, all the, think of it as all the, um, the specialist intellectual workers that rely on information. The information um, worker is obsolete in the next 10 years. So, um, you know, so one of the things that Japan's gonna have to do is to completely revolutionize their, their education system. And again, that's, you know, I'm a, I've been a teacher for 10 years. I know the education system. I got two kids in it. Um, um, the opportunity is for, for uh, us to develop the, uh, the Eduit. The Eduit is an e-singularity platform that does all the, the driving for learning for the child. So it starts with a baby as an iPad. Oh, look, there's a worm. I should bring, there's a worm. He's moving. See, I figured out what it is, is that he's trying to get over there. You know, there's a lot more stuff over there. And he's making the path across this oasis. That one didn't make it. But this guy looks like he is, uh, he's getting there. We'll see on the way back whether he gets there or not. So um, the, the opportunity is to have a device that basically teaches babies uh, Japanese and English and Chinese um, and Korean, right? The three major languages in the area autonomously teaches it them just by using um, uh, mimics. Uh, and I've talked about it in, in other videos, uh, imprinting and um, model, uh, modeling the way they lear learn language, right? How does a baby learn language? Well, you, AI um, basically does the same thing and uses the same uh, techniques to, to, to uh, launch that language development. And, uh, and then as uh, the child gets older, it's teaching them math and then science. So by the time the kid is, you know, and this is, it goes with them, they don't need books anymore. You don't need bags of books or anything else. You have one device that does it all. It goes with them to kindergarten. It goes with them. It becomes their, uh, their uh, 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 Tamaguchi, Tamaguchi, a little electric thing that actually launched in uh, 2019. So it becomes their Tamaguchi, it, their friend, they drag it behind them as a baby, it talks to them, it minds them, and it's constantly giving data and information to the parents um, of what's going on. Um, and uh, it gives, you know, because the AI is, uh, here's another guy, like going across. Uh, because the AI is a specialist in child development and everything else, yeah, I definitely need to go get my, yeah, I should have grabbed my damn, um, my little thing. Anyway, it's raining. I'm gonna leave it. Leave them. Leave them be. Um, it will. It will develop. You know, with them. So the uh, the opportunity for me, and this is a great thing. Is my master's is in nonprofit administration, and uh, uh, it's a uh, MFA MBA in nonprofit administration management with a focus on on raising grant money. What was limited me here in the past in Japan is I don't, I can't, you know, I can't communicate in Japanese and writing and everything else. Well, that has changed with chat GPT. Uh, now I am fluent in it. So it means I can write proposals. Um, I can uh, write, uh, which is this what I'm going to start to doing today when I get done with this talk. 
um, to draft up a whole plan for revitalizing Japan's education system um, and uh, in initiating um, Eduit Japan, which will be set up as a GIF, it's a type of nonprofit in Japan that is seeded with an endowment. So I'm gonna be actively looking for a $5 million endowment for this nonprofit. Uh, the endowment is going to give, give the person on the board. Um, that 5 million is gonna be held in escrow with the, um, you know, um, on a third party escrow uh, invested um, into cryptos, smartly invested into cryptos, mainly into Bitcoin. The 5 million we basically bought into Bitcoin. And, uh, um, and then it will pay out the interest um, of uh, to the organization. So the pr the primary amount won't be touched; just sit in Bitcoin. So if uh, if there is no you know interest generated um, out of it, and other there's other staking cryptos and stuff that we can stake it in, but it'll be professionally managed. And and the endowment is going to fund Eduit um, Japan and the development of Eduits, the e Singularity uh, platform which will you know, be a lot like an iPhone, iPad that can slide into, build on open source um, technology um, and uh, you know, made available for anyone to basically use, license and develop. So the key thing is we wanna bring about e-singularity as fast as we can. We can do so now working together. Um, and the three stages, that's the first stage is you know is is education the second second stage is once we have that obey will replace the managers right the managers the accountants the lawyers because that, that by by training it on education ultimately it has developed and we've tested everything else in it so all of the information workers will be replaced um and that is uh, the age of days so decentralized autonomous entities come come about because now um, Obey, Open Beneficial AI that's running education, now is running these entities. And the cool thing about these entities is they uh, don't give money to, uh, to uh, political groups, they don't give money to politics. So imagine now you have thousands of, of these decentralized, uh, distributive, autonomous entities, days, launching, the found up days, we'll, we'll call it, launching, built on this AI, I'm giving it circa 2025, right? So 2025 will launch days. And these entities, you know, uh, uh, the doubt, uh, the day, uh, the obey does all the accounting, all the legal, all everything else, files all the taxes, does all that stuff. There's no board members. Um, the days all work together as a beneficial kadetsu. So, you know, if another day is, needs, you know, operating cash to do something, it's no problem. They, 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 the, the AI is constantly spreading back and forth. And the age of the 15th century corporation that is responsible, the Ouroboros of capitalism is over. And you can read my article on that, you know, um, I'm gonna link all my articles below. So, uh, undow do. The full vision now is manifested that I've been talking about for, well, started in 2000 with Eduit, but I'd say um, mid 2007, started talking about it, moving it, reaching it. All the pieces now are clear, concise, and there. And this buddy right here, 0202, and now this is another reason why that me and him together, right? Me and him together are going to assemble the other doist so there's a doist these are the doists the 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 sadus of the fifth age the 19 sadus there are the 19 that built it which i've talked about in the past and now there's the 19 that are going to usher it in my question to you are you one of them <laughs> now there are some strict things you got to read my paper on doism below you know we're you know just like you know christianity was called a cult right and uh so was um you know islam was called a cult at one point and Every, I'm sure people are going to call Dewism a cult. We're not. We're metaphysics. And if you read my paper, you'll see what I'm talking about on Dow Dew.